Hey there, Shuby Doodlers, how are you doing? Welcome to another of my Draw Along Faces. Uh, and this is a guy called Dave. You can go to shoerainer.com courses slash courses and download this uh, sheet and join along with me. And the whole point of these videos is to show you how with really, really simple lines, you can create quite complex characters uh, for if you want to do illustrations and things like that. So uh, I'm going to draw Dave's eyes pretty much there. And I pretty much start like this with all of these drawings that I do. From here, I'm going to come up a little bit like that. And then I'm going to go across like that and up to there. And then here I can come slightly around and down a bit there like that. So that's got the, the kind of the fringe part sorted out. And we'll maybe have a couple of little lines coming down there. Then we're going to, from the parting, we're going to come around like that. And from the parting, we'll come around like that. And like that. And like that. And on this side, we'll have from the parting, we'll come down there and down there and then round and round and maybe a couple of bits sticking up there and maybe another little bit there just to even things up. Now I'm going to take his chin down a little bit below that line and, and I'm going to make it go quite straighter up there. So we've got a slightly different shape to the face. So it's coming down and then across like that. So we've got a different shape to the face that we've been normally doing, a bit longer face. And I'm going to give him slightly quizzical eyebrows. Hmm. <laughs> and he can have a, a longish nose as well. And a, hmm, kind of thinking about it sort of face. And I'm going to give him very, um, very long, open kind of neck. Kind of like that, and I'll put a bit of check in on the collar, like that, and sort of very rounded shoulders, like that, and maybe you know that's the rib around the collar there, like that. If you haven't already, hit the subscribe button and ring the bell so you get notified every time I upload new videos to help you improve your creative skills. Let's give him a totally different expression because that's also what these videos are about. It's showing how with these very simple lines and it's usually the mouth and the eyebrows that really do it. Um, you can have a completely different expression. So let's do the wiggly bits inside the ears like that. So that's like a question mark and that's like an S. And let's start here and we're going to go across and down like that and maybe a couple of little bits there and then we'll come around and around and around and around and maybe a bit more there and here that's quite an S sort of shape and then we'll do more curvy kind of shape there like that and maybe a little two little bits sticking out there. These are the hair is kind of leaning over to one side of it. Let's make him look a little bit surprised this time so I'm going to draw his chin down there to give me something to aim at and then we're going to go kind of straightish and then up here we're going to go straightish and then up and a long nose and then um and an O so this isn't quite a whole O it's a bit flatter on the bottom and we'll see his tongue like that and maybe his teeth and then we can shade all of that in so it's kind of what expression is that what has he seen <laughs> put your thoughts in the comments box down below and maybe we're going to have this slightly differently here so we're going to have uh the collar kind of like that and his shoulders are much more hunched because he's a bit sort of surprised by what he's seen. Um, and we've got the um, armpits and things in there. And we'll have a bit of check going on in there like that. Check plaid. You may call it plaid. I call it check. 
Uh, if you want to, you can add a little bit more detail into the hair, which gives a bit more kind of sort of texture to it, I suppose. And um, what it basically is kind of splitting the middle of the thing that you've done already. Like that, 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 and in the middle, in the middle, in the middle, in the middle, in the middle. And if you wanted to, you could give him a bit of shadow underneath the chin there. And maybe a bit of shadow in there as well. And this person I am calling Dave. So there you go. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Make sure you are subscribed to the She Read and Drawing channel and keep coming back for lots more How to Draw People Faces. In the meantime, keep drawing, drawing, drawing. Practice, practice, practice. And I'll see you next time. You take care now. Bye-bye.